Younger era, we had we were not winning. We were finishing comfortably fourth place or top four. Finished the Champions League without only silverware. We went nine years without a trophy until we won the FA Cup. We're literally doing the same thing over and over. If we don't win this year, what Nico, is not more. what? What no, are we gonna we judge Arteta on? Like, what are we gonna judge? No, I have to. I have no, no, to. Because, I'm cooking for you. Let me talk. Let me talk. Man, We're listening. Go Listen, on. Man. I'm just saying, fam. If there's not gonna be any accountability on Mikel Arteta, I don't want to be an Arsenal fan anymore because I don't want to be a mediocre fan. Leave. Bro. I don't want to be boring. I don't want to finish Damn, top we four. Don't want you. I've been crying about that for a majority of my life supporting this football club. Why am I not gonna? Why am I gonna stop complaining bro. about it now? No, no, because you uh, guys, are, you guys have yeah. accepted under Mikel Arteta this boring mediocrity. This fam, second is successful to you guys. I'm sorry. Who cares about <laughs> niggas who finish second, bro? If I'm, if I'm, listen, twenty. Years down the line no one's gonna remember arsenal finishing second in the 2023 season 2024 everybody's gonna remember who finished first okay so i don't are know what this memorable thing is for everybody i don't know right. anyways go ahead our arf when was the last time when your challenge for tro- for for the premier league Leicester season it wasn't that long ago 2016, challenge. and we got challenge. mad at that we challenged we were first Ch- for the majority of the season i mean not majority then, but we were there we yeah, beat that's, them we that's beat the, them. that's the season you threw away mm-hmm before we that, what was the beat last one? Them and t- took before the that, break. before that, what was the last one? It was multiple season, season brother. Before, no, yeah, for, no, it was not always, the season before. Finishing ace, ace, second no, no, does not mean you were well, challenging go for back, the league. Go back, season before you go finished. back, Achi. go back. We've always been no, first no, no. for like the first three months, and then November or December comes in, Christmas time. We just turn off, and then we comfortably we'll make like okay. a little Champions League round, and we're like, oh my god, quarter, round of sixteen, quarterfinals okay. against Bayern. Maybe we have a chance. It's the same. I hear you guys. I hear you guys. But what I'm saying is. There's a difference between finishing second and challenging for the league. Man United had years where they finished second. Okay, you're doing they the did not challenge no, no, for no, the no, league. We'll if you do the comparison, you, we are Arsenal. Are you going to let me land? Are you going to let me land? No, are you going to let me land? Are you going to let me land? So there's a, there's a distinction there. We mm. are comfortably challenging for the league. And we, I could say this, we bottled the league within the last month, two years in a row. Oh. Okay? So... There is progression to us almost achieving what we what we want. We're going against, because you have to always look at it with context, the best team in Premier League history. No ifs, ands, or buts. And we're almost there. And for some reason, you want to turn around and slate the guy who's taking us there? Yes. We're yes, getting better we every season. For Wenger, You're mad at the transfers, even Sir though there was... Alex Ferguson, was, one of the greatest he's managers at the club for ever. 19, 20 years, bro. What are you talking about? That's cool. That's cool. You're not going to so give you, a little grace? So, okay, no, no. So you want to give him 19 What manager do you, you want to replace no, him? That's okay, the argument no, no. too. Ace, what ace, what ace, manager ace, do you want to replace ace, ace, him? Ace, ace. What's the winning formula for Real Madrid, for freaking Barcelona, for freaking... You think Man City would have kept Guardiola if they lost all those years? After the first season, he was getting freaking... Uh, little bit of you know a harsh treatment because remember he didn't win anything the first season they said yo sex season you're pep guardiola you gotta win something after so you want to be like chelsea and just fire your i want to be like Bayern. yeah no no i want to be like Bayern. i want to be the big dogs i I want there to be a little bit of accountability i want there to be accountability i don't want to replace me don't you agree that being comfortable is the most dangerous thing in the world being comfortable with what you have is the most dangerous thing in the world arteta is not comfortable he's 100 percent not comfortable i mean no but our fans are comfortable i'm not talking about arteta i know he wants to win Arteta's I'm talking about the Arsenal guys. Fans. Bro, I, I, I don't know what you're trying to say. Who is our replacement? That's the argument. I'm just saying, y'all, t- y'all too okay with losing, bro. And you don't y'all, have an answer. Way too so okay what are we talking y'all, about? Y'all too. Bro. I'm not an Arsenal fan. Don't go say on, y'all too. Go on, Mo. Go on, Mo. <laughs> I saw it's a couple of things. Um, one, I don't think... Our, I've said it before. I don't think Arteta's going to get you guys to win. I, I don't think he's, he's a winner like that. Cool. So you want to keep a guy like that? <laughs> <laughs> wait, no, wait, 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 wait. No, 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 that's what he said. Byron won it all, though. I don't care. Okay? No, but Byron got company because they, they, they burned how many bridges, bro? Yeah, they we, had Nagelsmann and got rid of him. That's more recent, though. We know Byron of Byron, okay? We know the winner. But Actually, no, well, I, no, go back to your but point, look, fam. You just okay, said you, point, know, you think this. he's not a winner. Why would you want to keep a guy who's not a I don't think a he's a winner, but I think, I, think, I think there's something to say that, he, that he's definitely improves your team. And like until you get, you get to a point where you're actually stagnating, I don't know if you should just get rid of him. Because if you look at it year after year, Arsenal has improved. The amount of points they've gotten has always improved. The league position, other he's, than last season, more really, time they than most got the same amount. Yeah, and he took a team that was clearly on the downhill when Wenger left, mm-hmm. took them, rebuilt them, and now you have a team that's competing for the league. 
what he needs to do, in my opinion, is compete for other things as well. You can't just only compete for the league. You need to be competing for Champions League, Every for trophy. the other cups. Like, you need to be trophy. making, yeah. yeah, you need to be making real, real runs into those competitions. You can't be losing Every round of 60, Carabao Every year, FA and you Cup, know what? Maybe. Aim jam with you. End of season. If it's the same story, thank you. Sack him. Get a new manager. Thank you. But, but it's for him to lose. I think you got to It's for him to lose. Like at this point, it's. I don't think we're at a point now at the beginning of the season where you should say, "Oh, sack this guy." No, I think he's improved. He's made your team better. But you're looking for more, and you want ambition. I can understand that. Thank but you. who are you going to bring in? To Ace's point, it's always. Amazing.